Hello, everyone. I'd like you to think about those moments between things. The moments where you're making a transition from one thing that you've focused on and you're, you're choosing then to focus on something else. Are you satisfied with the choices that you're making in those moments? Are they deliberate? Are they well-informed? Could you justify those choices that you're making? Or are you finding that you're basically just being driven by whatever's arriving in your world? I was uh, reading uh, or rereading an article um, I absolutely love. There's a, uh, a Zen master, Buddhist teacher, um, uh, a Vietnamese um, peace activist named uh, Thich Nhat Hanh. And Thich Nhat Hanh took that great old quote, don't just sit there, do something. And he turned it on its head. He said, in many cases, what we find is that it's more helpful for us not to do something, but rather to sit there. And I know in hearing that you might be thinking, well, hold on, then I'm wasting time. I'm being lazy. I'm not being effective, not using my, you know, my resources to, to best effect. But let me try to make a case for this. If we do find that we take a moment and we carefully consider what we do next, then we almost certainly are going to make better choices. You know, one of my favorite um, thought experiments, ask yourself the question, the next time you're between things and you're drawn, let's say, to your email inbox, what are the chances that of all of the things that you could focus on in that moment, your email inbox would be the best thing? And, and the top email, the last thing to arrive, would be the best thing for you to focus on. What are the chances? I'm not saying it's impossible. It could very, you know, it, it could be that that, uh, that last email to arrive is, you know, something critical that really does need your focus straight away. But in most cases, I think we're just driven. We're driven by what's coming at us. So the next time you find yourself in that moment, take a beat, right? Just to be clear, in that moment that you're you know, choosing what else to focus on, the ideal situation is that you are supported by a system which gives you options, right? By what we call a trusted external system, a system that's not in your head, that gives you options for focusing so that you can have some confidence that the thing that you're focused on next is the right thing for you. So next time you get tempted to just do something, just sit there. I hope that was helpful. Um, as always, please do like and subscribe. And if there's anything else that we can do to support you on your journey to stress-free productivity, please let us know. Bye for now.